we're going to create a path. And we're going to begin at the beginning, which is the title, Pandas, which has that picture. Zoom in to where we can see it really well. Right now, it is number one. It is the first spot on our little tour here. So I'm going to zoom in. When it gets fuzzy, that means you zoomed as far as you can. Let me zoom out a little bit and the whole thing is in there. Right, that's the beginning of our present. That is one. All right, the next thing I want to happen is I want the focus to go to this arrow that's leading us to the next part, but I don't want it to look so huge. So I'm going to zoom out a little bit, then click it. Now that's the next thing you'll see. All right, we're going to go from that to our piece of text. Let me slide over here, and this is why it's important to leave some space between your parts of your Prezi. If you notice, I've got everything running together so you can see the other parts. That's not a good idea. But let me zoom out a little bit, get it exactly where I want it, and you can see that blue flashing thing that's the center of your Prezi at the present moment. So get it exactly where you want it, and then click it. That is now item number three. And actually, I don't like that. I should have zoomed out more. I want to see the whole circle, so I'm going to remove that point. Zoom out, and then add it back. And now you look, you see more of the circle. All right, moving on, we've got our two lines. I'm going to zoom in on those and let that be the next point in our Prezi. I have zoomed in too far. There we go. So that will be the next thing they see. Then I want our video to be the next thing. So I'm going to zoom way out for that. I want it to be the only thing on the stage. Zoom out and select it. All right, now this next part is the text box. Link. So we've got the text box. All right, zoom out. And here's our final bit of text. So I'm going to zoom in on that. This is where we have stuff hidden. Select it. All right, now I want to zoom first into the video. If you remember, it's way down here. Keep zooming, keep zooming, keep zooming. And you'll see it becomes clear as you zoom. And we want it where those blue lines are. One more. There we go. So click on it. And now it's going to zoom into that image. And I'm going to zoom back out so we can see that it's part of this text. So I'll select that text again. That's the next thing. Now we're going to zoom back in to that little bit of tiny text we put. I think it was at the period here. There it is. it up where that blue is. There we go. Alright, click on it. It's the next item in the path. And then let's zoom back out so we can show that it is all part of that same bit of habitat. That, so each of these, the video, a little bit of information about the mountains of China, this is all part of this paragraph. So there's a reason we're zooming in and out. It's all about habitat. So I'm going to click it one more time, and we get the full habitat one. All right, and so the only thing left now is to go to the point where we ask if there are any questions. So I'm going to zoom in on that, put it in the center, a little bit, 
that's actually too much and select it and that's it it saves automatically but um, we're going to save our very last one and click show and you see starts the show with our first line on our path click next the next item in our path you could have zoomed out or in further depending on how you wanted to do it this is the next one again i probably should have zoomed out further here to show the whole circle but information about the order and species our drawn lines could have looked nicer i might have drawn a picture of a panda or something we come to our youtube video Again, very short, but very cute. All right, the next thing in our path was some text. So you, give, you give yourself time to read it to your students. And then you go to, this is the text that has so much going on. It's about the habitat. It's plenty of room to read it. Now watch what happens with the Zoom tool. You're zooming in, and there's the baby pandas. So when you click next, it's going to show you that that was a period. It's all hidden inside of this bit of text. And we've got another zoom in. So you click next. You find out that they live in a few mountain ranges in central China, etc., etc., etc. And it zooms back out to show that we're talking about the habitat the whole time. And then the following. And again, that probably could have been zoomed out more. You can tinker with this. You can delete points on your path and reposition your zoom tools. So very simple, very basic um, Prezi, and this is what I want you to create. Anyone can do this. It's just a matter of throwing some things on a wide open canvas and then using the path to zoom in and create a storyline out of those items.